Welcome back, everyone. Sheepdog Smokey here, and Warren Wilhelm Jr., more commonly known as Bill de Blasio, has officially stated, after spending God only knows how much, to send hundreds and hundreds of meals to Muslims during Ramadan, while ignoring that a group of Muslims is squatting in a Catholic church and holding prayer services and, and God only knows what else. While ignoring all that and sending free food to them, He's ordered Jews to stay home, not go to funeral services or any other religious service, or they will be arrested. It's, it's never really surprising to me that Democrats can do this kind of thing, because in their mind, they actually see nothing wrong with appeasing a group that wants us dead and subjugating a group that actually does have the right to gather for religious reasons. Kentucky sent cops to ticket people and take down license plate numbers because of a drive-up church service. They weren't sitting in the sanctuary. They weren't standing shoulder to shoulder. They were sitting in their cars as families, listening to a service on the radio. I'm personally surprised that drive-in movie theaters did not protest the shut down. They could have easily shut down concessions and said, we're just going to show the movie. People will be told not to get out of their cars unless they're going to the restroom or even go to the restroom early. They will be in their car, not sitting together, not close. For crying out loud, we're not told you must quarantine yourself in your own home six feet from your family. So why can't we sit in our cars? I understand what he is saying and his twisted logic that the order of six feet apart, no more than ten, blah, blah, blah. But you see, there's that pesky First Amendment. Congress shall make no law respecting an establishment of religion or prohibiting the free exercise thereof. When he actually says that it is illegal to gather for religious services, that is a blatant violation of the First Amendment. I would personally, were I in New York, defy him. I would probably end up representing myself and then asking the judge, uh, Your Honor, why did he send meals to Muslims during Ramadan and why is he ignoring a group squatting in a Catholic church holding their services, but I can't exercise my First Amendment rights? And when I'm acquitted, sue him for everything he's worth. From Prince to Pauper, I would absolutely love to see a penniless de Blasio crying in the media about how he was targeted and punished for just trying to help. When it's convenient, everything is my body, my choice, my body, my choice, my body, my choice. But when it's also convenient, it is, you will obey me from liberals. I really do hope that the people of New York City wake up to the fact that Bill de Blasio, Warren Wilhelm Jr., is a tyrant who should be removed from office, either by recall or being voted out, and he should be shunned. Andrew Cuomo is the same. Jay Inslee, Gretchen Wilmer, Gavin Newsom, Pelosi, Schumer, Feinstein, Waters, Booker, Harris, AOC, Tlaib, Omar, all of them. They are showing their true colors, that they care nothing for the Constitution, nothing for the rights of the citizens, nothing for actually representing the people that they are elected to represent. They care only for power, enriching themselves due to power, and doing anything they have to to maintain it. Do I think that will happen? No. Because New York has done like California and all but legalized voter fraud. Bill de Blasio has worked to make sure he stays in office, but as soon as he decides he wants to retire... He'll put those term limits right back in place so that no one other than him 
benefits from his little tyrant move. I don't know what else I can say about it. The man is reprehensible. He is an imbecile of the highest order. And in my mind, he should be forcibly removed from office and charged with violating the constitutional rights of New York City residents and citizens. But unfortunately, he, like most Democrats, has judges in his pocket to hold him to him for anything and everything he can get on them. So he'll likely never face any repercussions for his tyranny. I don't know. Let me know what you think. As always, be civil. If de Blasio or any of the others I named show up, I'll be blunt, but I won't be vulgar. The rest of us, we are logical, civil adults. We can dissent, discuss, and debate like adults. And that is what I require here. I don't say you have to believe it the same way I do. You don't have to agree. You just have to agree that everyone has the right to their opinion, and we will be civil when discussing those. As always, please remember to like and share the video to widen the conversation and grow the channel. I'm doing the giveaway at 500, 1,000, and 1,500 subscribers. The faster we get there, the faster that happens. So make sure you subscribe and turn on notifications so that you are, pardon me, aware of all content as it posts and part of the crowd for the giveaway. Until next time, be safe, smart, and healthy, and everyone have a wonderful day.